What's going on guys? Your boy Micah here coming at you. Do y'all hear that? And today, I'm filming with this guy. So today I'm out at Carl Barton Park, which is a local park where I live. And uh, <laughs> decided to bring my folks dog out. I love this dog. His name is Boy and he's a rescue dog. They rescued him as a little bitty pup. And now he's a full grown doggy. So that's it. Yeah. How did you do today? I took it a little easy. Took it easy, eh? And I chilled with the uh, homeboy. Also, I filmed on the gimbal. If you did notice, the shots were a little smoother and cleaner and seamless. And that's because I filmed with this. A Zinyun. I believe you pronounced that that way. I have no idea. Nobody on the internet knows how to pronounce it properly either uh, in all the videos I've looked at. So this is a crane. This is the version one and it works on three axes. So we have the first one, we have the second one, and then we have the third one. So this makes shots seamless. It's based on a motor and you set, mount the camera there and you can set it to uh, several different ways to get the shots that you want. It's really a fantastic tool and I can't wait to get better on it to create really high-end professional videos. Because that's exciting for me. I love to create. Anyways, uh, Zin Yun, that's who makes it. So if you guys are interested, uh, this one holds up to four pounds on your camera. So if it's any more than four pounds, you got to go for another version. So this one is a smaller uh, mirrorless camera. No big DSLR, sorry. Uh, but yeah, that's that. All right, so what did you guys think about the McGregor Habib or Khabib, not sure how to pronounce it. What'd you think about that fight? Personally, the fights leading up to that were phenomenal, every single one of them. The Connor and Khabib fight was, man, they're two different fighters, right? Connor is like striker, ready to go, straight out the gate, ready to fight. Khabib is more of like a uh, strategist. He's taking to the ground, man. Ground game is his, and he certainly won. But did you guys see after? Like, that was nuts. Holy crap. They just all started fighting. I was like, what the hell is going on? Oh, okay, so something really interesting happened and I totally forgot to get it on my phone. So we're sitting there at this sports bar, right? And everybody's crazy, right, right, right. And then um, there's two guys and a girl and a little kid in front of us, right? They're just sitting in the booth, getting rowdy, you know, drinking continuously. I was just watching, I don't drink very rarely, but I was watching them, they were putting them down. He kept trying to talk to us and I'm like, look fool, I'm not interested in talking to you, man, you know? And I wasn't rude, I was just kind of minding my own business, right? Um, Cause he was little, I don't know. I didn't want to get involved with him, put it that way. Uh, so after the fight, everybody was just crazy, right? And he, I didn't see exactly what happened, 
But one of the guys picked up a kid. The kid was probably about like four years old. He was sleeping. I was like, why do you have a kid at a sports bar at midnight? But uh, he was holding the kid. Then the other guy was jumping around and then somehow I guess they pushed each other. And then they started like pushing each other like aggressively, like about to fight. Meanwhile, they're holding this kid. The glass got knocked off. That caused all sorts of stuff. The woman started freaking out. Uh, and then that kind of calmed him down. I'm not about to step into that, right? Unless that kid's endangered. I don't know. Do you agree or disagree? I stayed back, you know, I kept my distance, but then the cops came over and they escorted that fool out. I wish I would have got that on camera. This is what I do. I always have a camera on hand and I didn't record it. It's stupid. So I thought that was interesting. People always get like that. It's just alcohol and that doesn't mix, you know? And, uh, it was just, there was fights all around. Anyways, that concludes today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed today's content, guys. Trying to bring in some more uh, shots with that gimbal and step up my game, because that's what it's all about. As usual, thank you guys for tuning in, and if you're new to the channel, welcome. If you enjoyed today's content, go and hit that little thumbs up. If you'd like to see more content and see where this vlog goes, because of 365, yes, one year, go and hit that little subscribe button. Other than that, guys, keep learning, growing, and moving.